Hi there. In this video of profit loss and discount, we are going to solve two questions related to profit and loss. In the first question, we are given selling price of two jeans, whereas in the second question, we are given cost price of two saris. Now let's look at the first question. Ankit sold two jeans for rupees 990 each. On one he gains 10% and on the other he lost 10%. Find his gain or loss percent in the whole transaction. Now let's take the first case. Selling price of one's jeans is equal to rupees 990 and gain is 10%. Now cost price will be equal to selling price into 100 upon 100 plus profit percent. We shall substitute the values now. 990 into 100 upon 100 plus 10 percent. By further calculation, we will get the cost price equal to rupees 900. Now let's take the second case. Selling price of second jeans is also 990 rupees. Now loss is 10 percent. So cost price is equal to Selling price into 100 upon 100 minus loss percent. We shall substitute the values now. 990 into 100 upon 100 minus 10 percent. By further calculation, we will get the cost price of second jeans as rupees 1100. Now, total selling price is equal to SP1 plus SP2 equal to 990 plus 990 is equal to rupees 1980. Now total CP is equal to CP1 plus CP2 is equal to 900 plus 1100 is equal to rupees 2000. Now since total cost price is greater than total selling price, there is a loss in the transaction. So loss is equal to total cost price minus total selling price which is equal to 2000 minus 1980 that comes to rupees 20. Now loss percentage we will calculate on the total cost price that is loss upon total cost price into 100%. We shall substitute the values 20 upon 200 into 100 is equal to 1%. So the total loss percent is equal to 1%. Now let's take up the second question. Nidhi purchased two saris for rupees 2150 each. She sold one sari at a loss of 8% and the other at a gain. If she had a gain of rupees 1230 on the whole transaction, find the selling price of the second sari. Now over here the cost price of both the saris is same that is 2150. But one we are selling at a loss of 8%. So we'll calculate the loss which is equal to loss percent into cost price upon 100. We shall substitute the values now. 8 into 2150 upon 100. So we'll get the loss rupees 172. Now we know that the total gain is 1230. Gain on second sari will be total gain plus the loss on first sari, which is equal to 1230 plus 172 will get rupees 1402 as a gain on second sari. Now, cost price of second sari is already given to us 2150, and gain on second sari we have calculated 1402. So selling price of second sari is equal to cost price plus gain which comes to 3552. So this is how we have solved this question. Thank you.